Hello guys, Cosplay Gamer 907 here, and welcome back to F1 2012. Fuck it. Cosplay Gamer 907 here, and welcome to F1 2014 Season Challenge. Finally got it right this time. Where we are at Russia for the Russian Grand Prix, funnily enough. Um, as I'm recording this, um, I think Practice 3 for the Canadian Grand Prix is underway. Um, episode 3 premiered at 9 o'clock this morning on my channel, so do check that out. Um, all playlists for the season challenge are in the description bar below so if you haven't seen one before and it's the first one you're watching I'd advise you to you know go watch 2012, 13, 14 so far and you're up to date or if you have seen any of them um, you haven't seen episode 3 yet uh, check that out because there's a lot that happens in that race um, so yeah I will get straight into it Now we nearly won in Belgium, will we win or even get anywhere near the top half of the field? I don't have any curs, well I'm sorry not curs, which makes, here we go, DRS me up. Oh I missed the apex, just about got that back on track. It's a bit more difficult because I have to open the steering up a bit. Oh no, I oversteered mid corner. Got that horribly wrong. You can see I've lost all the time I had. Oh, I'm so I'm struggling so much on the circuit. You take off my tiger, but I'm at, Yeah, I'm nowhere. I'm absolutely nowhere near this, has been a horrifying lap. I'm absolutely nowhere near. Look how much I've lost. Oh my god. Absolutely awful lap. This has probably been the worst qualifying lap I've ever done in the game. Yeah, I think I've gone the wrong way on setup here. I should have tried to change it a bit. I mean, look, it's so far gone. Across the line and with P18. Uh, I was behind my teammate by a whopping nearly nine nine tenths of a second behind my teammate. And in terms of my rival, which is Ricardo, oh my god. I'm nearly three seconds behind him. I'm going to have to have a worldly start. I was alright in the first sector seat. If I'd kept up the seven tenths bit, that would have been enough for third row. But I just lost it in the final two seconds of the lap. It's like the car's quick in the first sector. But second and third, I just haven't got the downforce on it. Which means I'm going to really struggle in the race. I'm just getting into a Galaxy Caramel. So oh, a big shout out to the like of um, Matty uh, Cosplay. Now that's only appreciated society, um, usual people, so hello.
So, can we get into the top half of the top 10? Or on the fringes of the top 10? Um, to have any chance. So I really need to be top 10 wise. And the first lap. And there's five laps. So yeah, we just got, we just got to go track and hope for the best, guys. So uh, yeah. Cheers for that um, unknown inside Crofty. Okay, my target, as you can see in the graphic, is 10th place. Slight bit of wheel spin. Oh, it's everyone's favourite driver. It's Maldonado. Oh, Grosje on the French baguette. Maldonado's going right. I'm going to try to go through the middle. Oh, I could be getting a squeeze on. Oh, inside, inside. Oh, Raikkonen. Raikkonen. Oh, my God, it's, it's Magnussen and Perez. Oh, I had to get out the throttle. Oh, my God. Where have I gone? Up the inside, can we make it stick? Yes, Magnus has been a bit slow. We might get him, lads. Oh, P10 already. Fucking hell, it's happening. Oh, I'm going to squeeze him out a bit. Up into P9, here we go. Can we have a go at Hulk? Oh my god, that was so close. I'm not going to lie, I actually crapped myself a bit there. P9. All I've got is tyres and brakes to play with, and that's not good, but P9. Nearly lost my front wing with Hulkenberg. Can we try a bit of a dive? But, oh my god, how have I not broken my front wing? I was slammed in the back of Hulkenberg. Right, okay, let's see if we can get. Look what, oh my god, the distance. It's like, at this point, I, I don't even know what I'm doing here. I've gone to that side, so we're going to switch right back. You can clearly see, at this point, I don't know what I'm thinking here. I've got, I've slammed on the brakes, the closing speed is ridiculous. Yeah, you can see, you can clearly see from the tyre marks. I've locked up, and Hulkenberg's going so slow, I'm pushing him through the corner. And then I've just gone, like, up the inside, and job's done. Um, oh, Steve Policeman caught that there. Bottas, about three Bottas. Think about it. Oh my god, Bottas go quicker. Oh my god, the car's oversteering like a nun. Yes, I know I caused the collision. Oh my god, back end. I've gone off to Mars. Right, so arrival is third, and I've got about four laps. Possible if I can catch Massa. Well, I'll tell you what, there's a bit of a train. Corner cutting, yes, I know. There is a bit of a train going on here. Oh my god. Oh my god, how I didn't lose my front wheel, how I don't know. Oh, I'm locking up. Come on, I've got to grip here because this is ridiculous. Right, let's change to rear brakes. 
slightly better. Oh, oh I can come on! This Tarasso is, it's, it's, this car is like a dog round rusher. I can't get anything going for right for it. It suddenly helped me out a bit. I'm all over Massa. Hang on, is that? That's even button. Oh my god, it's Rosberg. Rosberg's had a shocker start. That probably explains why it's the key. So I'm guessing Alonso second, Ricardo third. Alright, lads, here we go. Tell you what, actually, second second might be on there, lads. Oh my god, I've gone wide, I've gone wide. Come back in, hug the curb, out wide, break, too far wide, still made the corner. Well, where have I gone? All right, you people saw nothing. Back into rear for the break bias. Oh my god, that is the worst slide I've ever taken. And now again, oh my god. I'm making up my own track here at this point. And now again. I don't have DRS. Oh my god, come on. I've done personal best in the middle sector. Jeff, shut up! The annoying thing is, I can see my rival in third place up ahead and I, the car's not quick enough in a straight line. Oh my god, that is filthy corner cutting. Oh, hang on. I might have DRS. Could I have DRS on Rosberg? What, you, you're kidding me? I haven't been given DRS. I'm less than a second behind him. I think this is where I've just got to go hell for leather. Balls to the brake bias being at the rear. If I need to get anything, it's got to be on this lap where I've got to be passing someone. Oh, please give me DRS for fuck's sake. Oh my god, I've not had DRS once in this entire Grand Prix. Still a person best of half a second. Oh my god, Ricardo is holding everyone up a fucking treat. So who the fuck's... Hang on a minute, who's in second place here? For, wow, this is about to be the longest train ever for a final lap. Tap on Rosberg. 44. Come on. I have to have DRS. Where is the DRS? I have to have it. 47.9. Oh, Hamilton. Fuck off. Yes, I've got DRS. I have DRS. Alonso. Oh, I can see Ricardo. Oh, Phil. Come on.
Best in the best first sector. Come on. Oh, this could happen. Oh my God, Vettel on Ricard. Vettel's holding up Ricardo. Ricardo's holding up Alonso. Come on, please, 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 with me. No, I don't have DRS. Shit. This may have to be. A no, I'm too far back for the ultimate dive bomb. Fuck, I'm too far back, but I'm still doing personal burst. Oh my god, I'm throwing this car all over the track. Oh, up the inside of Alonso, shit! My rival is there, from being nowhere on race, this could be. Are we going to go for the last corner dive bomb? We've gone for the corner dive bomb, Ricardo! We've got him! Yes! Oh my god! From where I was on lap one, 18 to P3 and I beat my rival on the last corner of the last lap. What a drive. Wow. And do you know what? I ended up getting fastest lap and all. What a beast of a lap. That is absolutely ridiculous, folks. You will never see a more dramatic season challenge race on my channel than that. That is just wow. The start of the penultimate lap, I was in fifth place. I overtook Alonso in the third to last corner, and I took Daniel Ricciardo for third place and to beat my rival 2-0 on the last corner of the last lap. Wow, just, just wow. And I am now fourth in the World Championship, uh, one point behind Ricardo. So, um, it's going good. Um, I've got a feeling, if I get offered the Red Bull seat, I'm going to take it. I mean, I've just got no words. What a race. It's been the most exciting race I've ever had. I went 18th to be 10th on lap one. And then I'm up to fifth. And then with a lap and a half to go, I'm in fifth place. If you'd said to me I would, I would be in P3, that, I'd laugh at you. What a result, guys. Absolutely fantastic. So yeah, um, this is a normal thing that happens, um, you get off of the contract, another top three finish in a Toro Rosso, Hamilton did get the win, and here we are folks, and this is going to be a special two part episode, I should have warned you, so there it is guys. Red Bull or stay with Toro Rosso and I know exactly what I'm going to do I'm going to accept the contract and I'll be moving to Red Bull to take Ricardo's place and be alongside Vettel Which I'm chuffed about that I've gone from is it Toro Rosso. Yeah, I've gone from Toro Rosso to Red Bull. That's just that's mint. <laughs> uh, qualifying now for the German Grand Prix. It just makes absolute perfect. It's like, who do I aim for my rival now? It's it's got to be Rosberg. Yeah, and this is my rival, Nico Rosberg.
and it's fair to say I'm not Rosberg's biggest fan, but this is just, it's like, you can't write this. It's like with Salba then Toro Rosso. So here we go. Pole position time was a 47.3. I did a 47.5. I was two tenths off of the pole lap. That's ridiculous. Um, oh, ah, um, it's raining in Germany. This is ironic because it was raining all yesterday. So we're going to go to qualifying and because it's going to rain in the race, I'm going to go for a wet setup. Funny thing is, if I beat Rosberg in the three challenges or in their first two, I could end up at Mercedes before the season challenge is over. <laughs> it's wet, wet. It's wet. It's raining, and we've gone for the full wet setup here. Here we go. Let's see how we go, boys and girls. Perfectly through. Just it feels weird me driving a Red Bull. Last time I drove a Red Bull on an F1 game, it was F1 2006, and I was David Coulthard. 1904. And that was like kind of my nearest challenge at this point. My target's seventh. Took a wider line so I could get the car straightened up, and that's absolutely worth a treat. We're now coming into the stadium section. Well, not quite, but we will be coming up to the Mercedes Benz grandstand. Still behind. I'll tell you what. Oh, I've run too wide. Oh, I've got it wrong. Right, I'm going to do a quick instant replay hit. Um, yeah. Could end up being a one to. I'm gonna. Ha I, I may have to blitz this last sector. Oh, I'm so annoyed with myself. I'm absolutely annoyed. I'm so annoyed with myself. Eight times off. I was leading, I was on course for pole in a debut race with Red Bull. Oh, I'm so, oh, I'm so annoyed with myself. Oh, I threw, I've thrown pole position away. I'm gutted. Um, the yeah, on to the race, but I'm happy with that fifth place, but that top ten's a bit of a mixture. Um, That is the annoying thing. But, I just showed, I've got the pace in the car. The car's quick in the wet. Ironically, it could have been a Red Bull 1-2 in Germany. See, can I win the race from fifth? 
all I've got to do really is finish ahead of Rosberg. Twenty percent Celsius, a hundred percent rain. So guys, here we go. And I'm just gonna add this. German Grand Prix in the wet. So here we are. In the Red Bull. There's Rosberg, my rival. Behind, in front. Can we beat Rosberg? The lights are on forever. And away we go. It's a pretty sluggish start. Rip. Rosberg's had a terrible start. I'm boxed in. I can't see a thing. I can't go. Oh my god. I fitted through those two. And it's ridiculous. I'm going alongside of Alonso. Yeah, Rosberg's had a terrible start. So. Vettel leads from Hamilton. They so very gentle on this first lap because I really don't want to lose a wheel or lose part of the front wing. Oh god, I was changing the brake pass while I was braking and that's not gone well. I think Bonnie's is third is okay, but second's my target, so I'd rather. Oh, there he goes, Rosberg. Oh my god. What? <laughs> Jeff, what have you been smoking? Why couldn't try to turn into me at a place where you can't turn in? Right, I've got to put this back to neutral because this isn't working man. Oh my god, Vettel and Hamilton are just like... <sighs> Very late on the brakes against Rosberg. There is no DRS because it's a wet race and I've got oversteer like you would not believe and I'm in a Red Bull. Oh my, what was Rosberg doing? I've just gone round the outside of him. Now, chasing after Alonso, here we go, we're coming towards the Mercedes-Benz grandstand. Do I dare risk it for a chocolate biscuit? No. Carl's over steering like a wet numb. Rosberg's trying to come back up here on the outside. No, you're not, mate. You're staying there. Oh my god, the back end. The car's over steering. I can't deal with the wet. On this game, I cannot deal with the wet conditions. Carl's an absolute true dog. Bell and Hamilton are already to turn one. Oh my god, that was. I'm so sorry, Alonso. <laughs> now, oh my god, I've just done a purple. I've done a purple first sector, caught up a second. Next target is about Kevin and Bottas. And I'm up to 
third. Hamilton's still in second, which is crazy. So Ravel's got some good pace, or Hamilton just can't get past him. God, I've done it again. Yeah, I haven't done anything we played to like change something happening in the race for a long time. Oh my God, where am I going? Thirty point six. Oh, my God. So I'm on course to beat Rosberg, but let's just thirty point six. Oh, that's ridiculous. Behave. Hold on, I've got a check. What's Hamilton's fastest lap? Oh my, so what's my teammates? That's... I'm the only guy in the 1 minute 30s. That's ridiculous. So that 4 or 5, I've just seen Hamilton and Wrestle go through the hairpin. Slightly an awful lot of ways to take a hairpin. Bottas, Alonso, Rosberg are the three cars behind me and they're not challenging me so I'm okay and I can really go on and well I'll say push but I haven't got the rich, the rich mix 3 option for fuel, in fact I haven't got fuel option at all which is shit, 4.8 Two second. Oh, engineer! Oh, don't talk to me when I'm breaking for a corner. Oh. like he's going to win this race. Hamilton's behind him, not sure by how much. Probably a second, maybe a second and a half. Yeah, there's Hamilton now. What's the gap at the second sector? Yeah, actually it's a lot closer. Yeah, it's 3.4. Oh, I've taken the shit right out of him. And I should have done that a lap ago. so much on him but uh, if I had one more lap on Hamilton I would have had him. Sebastian Vettel is going to win the German Grand Prix for Red Bull. Hamilton will be second and I will be third. It's a good recovery drive. Didn't quite finish second which was my target. But there we go. First race for Red Bull. Beat my rival. Finished on the podium. 30.681, the only man in the 1 minute 30s in the wet. 
and the next car that was even close to me was well we're both Hamilton and Vettel separated by a few hundreds so it just shows you like the pace is there the pace was there all weekend but I, I botched it up in qualifying so that's where I lost the race uh, so there we go guys that's the end of episode 4 uh, which will be titled Last Lap Drama and a New Team to which I all bid you a good farewell I've been Cosplay Gamer 907 until next time goodbye